Hi guys, this is going to demonstrate the concept of the singleton as an import for exported instances of objects or any object for that matter. So basically what happens if is if you import any object in ES6, it will become a singleton. There will be only one instance of that object no matter how many files are trying to import that object so to demonstrate that we have a very simple class here and we are exporting an instance of that class in our index uh, let's deal with that class so that would be the singleton object let me comment out the rest so we have here uh, modifiers so modifier 1 is simply an increment and modifier 2 is a double so in our index we simply get that we log the value so expectedly this should be 0 at this point and since the singleton object is the same so at this point it should be 10 because it's incremented and so it should appear here as 10 and then at this point, the sing singleton object, that value should be 20 because it is doubled. So modifier 2 simply doubles the value field of that object. So basically, after this demo, it should be uh, 20. So let's uh, run this quick demo. Let's clear that out and start debugging. We go to the console we see here that it is 20 so here the index is 20 so to demonstrate another aspect of this is that if there are many files modifying a singleton object that has been exported then they will all modify only one object so to demonstrate i have created here a a singleton global value changer what this is is basically an interval of five seconds and every time this happens it imports the singleton from the object definition here so it imports this and then the modifier from here and then does the modification so it basically doubles whatever the value is in the same singleton object and then prints it and then there's another modifier that happens every 2.5 seconds let's change that to 2.5 and this one to 10 i10 and this will be interval i 2.5 so that we can observe So basically, this other one also doubles the value but at 2.5 second intervals. And the same, it gets the value from the singleton object, which is this one, and not from the index. So let's run this. Try and delete this part of the code and and comment this comment this too so what happens is this gets incremented and then doubled and then the result would be 20 on the index but at the very start also these two changers are also being activated so every 5 seconds, this doubles the value, and every 2.5 seconds, this doubles the value. There is nothing on the index that indicates that single object was modified by other files, except here in these two files, because they import directly similar to how index imports. So let's try and run this. And observe the console. So we got index 20. And after 2.5 seconds, it gets doubled. And then after 5 seconds, it becomes 80. 
So as you can see, we now have two files that are trying to edit one single ton object in this case. So let me just pause this. So this should have been 5.0 and not I10. So let, let me modify this quickly. 5.0. This one is 2.5. But the whole point is that this this uh, file, this one, edited the same object that was edited by index. So it doubled that object 2.5 seconds later. And then the other file, this one, now i5.50 previously i10, edited the object that was edited by this file. Because they are all sharing one singleton object. It's like it's comparable to a static class instance in C Sharp and Java. So that's how import works in ES6.